My name is Thomas Lefford, and I'm here to share in this video a clarity worksheet. We're going to go through the first seven questions of the clarity worksheet, and inside this video, I'm going to leave you some information where you can click on the link and register for a free workshop that my mentor and coach is hosting starting June the 6th. So this video is all about you registering for the free workshop that starts June the 6th, and I'm going to leave you a link that's going to give you access to the clarity worksheet before the workshop starts. And so if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. Hit the bell for notifications so every time I go live or upload, you'll be notified. And so if you're looking to get started in business, regardless of what it is, uh, this workshop will definitely be of value to you. And if you're looking to start a business and you already know you're looking to start a business, then definitely register for the workshop and uh, subscribe to my channel and uh, check me out and by getting to know me through my videos. And so uh, we're going to get started by going through the first seven uh, questions of the Clarity Worksheet. And the first question is, what is the vision for your dream business? So you got to sit there and ask yourself, what is the vision for your dream business? And so a lot of times, you know, the word vision might not be something we hear a lot. And so we have to ask ourselves, what do, the, what do vision mean? You know, either we do a definition, look up of it, or we try to figure out on our own understanding what do vision mean to me. And so when it comes to asking yourself that question about what is my vision for your dream business, and that's something that's going to take time and thought that you have to go through when it comes to that. And so if you want to learn more about what your dream vision for your business looks like, you know, you want to definitely ready for the workshop. Uh, number two, why do you have, why do you believe you should create it? So based on the business you're talking about bringing to the marketplace, you got to ask yourself the question, why should it be you to make it happen? And so whatever that question, whatever the answer is, there's no right or wrong, it's what it is. And number three, how will your business or vision change lives? So based on the business and uh, you talk about bringing, uh, how will it change the lives of people who was designed to uh, benefit? You know, either major change, minor change, it doesn't matter. But what type of impact will your business make in the lives of others is the question. Uh, how is it different or similar to other online businesses that do something similar? So if you plan on starting a business and you're not planning on leveraging the Internet to build that business, then <laughs> you really want to reconsider that move. Because uh, I started out a traditional brick-and-mortar business. And I don't regret my journey, but knowing what I know now, if I knew that when I first got started in 2007, I would have definitely went straight online with it. But since I didn't have that knowledge and, and understanding about how to leverage the internet and I, let alone the mindset to even go that route at the time, then, you know, uh, it's, it's, there's no one to blame. There's no one to be mad at. It's just, you know, it runs its course when it runs its course. So, as I kept trying to grow and, 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 and build my business, and I decided, hey, the internet has got more and more popular, and it got more and more awareness to me, I decided to figure out how can I leverage my business uh, by using the internet. And so I found the mentor coach that I'm with today. Um, so her workshop is free, and it's designed to give clarity to people who already, A, have a business, or B, people who got skills, knowledge, and passion about something, who are looking to start a business but don't know how to make that work, don't know what that looks like, this workshop will definitely help you to get more clear on that. And then the next question was, what will you be selling in your business offering? So based on your business, if you're a service-based business or you or your retail business, what would you be selling? You know, I'm uh, in the tax preparation industry, you know, so I provided tax preparation services to my clients for the most part. You know, that was my primary uh, way of generating income was to help prepare individual income taxes uh, for taxpayers. And so that was what I was selling, was tax preparation services. And so you gotta ask yourself the question, what business offering will you be having? Six is what challenges have you faced in the past in trying to implement this vision? So if you never tried at all to even bring your business to the marketplace, then this question doesn't apply to you. But if you have, then you got to get honest with yourself, look in the mirror, and write that down. And seven, if you've never stated 
started, what held you back? So if you're the person who never started at all, and if you can honestly look in the mirror and look back and ask yourself, what was it that held you back from getting started? And uh, underlying the cause of not getting started at all, which could be procrastination, fear, you know, uh, not being clear or concise on what you really want to do for uh, starting a business, you know, so those are a few things to consider, but you have to really uh, dig, dig, dig deep to ask yourself the question of what held you back. And so those are the seven first questions that it asks you. Like I say, I'm going to make this worksheet available uh, for people who register for the workshop. And so once you register for the workshop, uh, you'll send me a, a, a verification that you registered and I'll add along to your email address and I'll email you over the clarity worksheet. That's how that works. So you register for the workshop. Once they send you uh, a verification to your email that you've registered, then you afford that to my email that's inside the description of my video. And once I receive your email verification that you registered for the workshop, then I'll send you over uh, the clarity worksheet that you can get started on now before the, before the workshop even start. So that's how that'll work. You know what I'm saying? So uh, if you not sure about what type of business you want to start, but you know in your heart you want to start one, definitely register for the free workshop, which starts June the 6th. And like I said, the first step is registering using my email address inside the description of the email to send me a verification that you did register. And then I'll send back to you um, the clarity worksheet that you can use to get started before the worksheet workshop to get started uh, starting June the 6th. And so that's how that'll work for people who plan on registering. I need proof of registration, uh, which is the email that you'll get from registry uh, that you afford to me. And then from there, I will send you out the clarity worksheet and I'll see you in my next video.